Uh, my name is Brendan McGowan and I'm the Education Officer at Galway City Museum and here we are in Clare Galway National School today to start a new project thanks to Creative Ireland and the project is a history of Galway and objects so we're out here in the school to share the stories of some objects with the kids and create some creative responses. My name is Dara Morn. I'm the fourth class teacher here in Clare Galway National School. Uh, the Galway City Museum came in today to do a hands-on and active learning lesson in the class, learning about history, combined with art and some drama. Well, what they did today was a different way of learning, but a very fun way of learning. So today we worked on a drama piece based on Porrick O'Connor. We took historical fact and we went off basically into space with it and let the imaginations be really sparked by what the children were doing. And I think just taking something, taking something fact-based and allowing the imagination to come in opens up a whole scope and actually brings it back to the fact-based thing. Do they want to know more about the original subject? Do they want to know more about the life of the person? So it's a kind of a human and an emotional interest, I think, that is connecting through drama for that. And we have found that traditional textbook teaching of history can be dull, uninteresting and irrelevant for some students. So participating in this project with Galway City Museum, A History of Galway in Objects, has helped to bring history to life for students in the classroom, helps them make connections with the past and also develops a sense of belonging and an empathy. Brendan from the Galway City Museum out to us today to talk about artefacts. And as we know, artefacts have a story to tell. But the great thing about introducing artefacts in the classroom is the children become historians. So they learn to ask the questions about the artefacts and they learn to give a voice to those artefacts. And with the help of Orla and Jojo today, the children got to interact with the artefacts in a very multi-sensory way, whereby they did some art, they did some drama, and they were very, very active in their learning because of that. It's an inclusive project in which children are active agents in their own learning, showing their learning in very creative ways and also communicating and using the language of history. And these are all key competencies which are recommended in the primary curriculum framework. We did some art, we did a bit of drama and we also learned a lot of history. The one thing that I very enjoyed was learning about the statue Porrick O'Connor. I learned about that four boys were missing on a statue and they ended up going to jail over it because they broke the head off and tried to steal it and make sure no one found it but then like the bus driver found it. Uh, the one activity I enjoyed today was the metal crafting. So the object that we were looking at today at Clare Galway National School was the mace of Galway. I looked at different materials that the children could have a hands-on experience of the detail because the mace is full of beautiful detail and different techniques. And the two techniques we were looking at was repousé and chasing. And in order for the children to have a hands-on learning experience, we used tin foil and cardboard. I think that visual art works well so if you're a pupil who learns differently, visually or through using your hands, I feel like it gets into your memory more and it becomes like a real tangible thing. I'm dyslexic myself, so I find hands-on learning actually helps me to remember more about history. I had a great time today because I was learning stuff that I usually wouldn't learn in my school. It was great to trial the project today in the classroom. It's a big learning for us to go and see how we use the kind of factual information with the creative side and merge them together. So it was great to see them learn about the objects and then do some creative response. It was really fun and I didn't actually realise how cool history could be learned. Mm -hmm.